Hello! Hello! Hello, gamers! Oh, we're here, gamers! How's everybody doing? I want to say, right off the bat, yeah. that Nugget Maber and Big Stevie Awesome both subscribed. Thank you both. And Nugget Mabers was a tier three for the tenth month in a row. <laughs> God damn! Wow. Nugget Maber, thank you so much for thank your you support. Thank you so much for the support. Oh, and it plays video games. Video games. Games. How's everybody doing tonight? Hello, everybody. Hi, everyone. I feel like I'm gonna read some names like Knit Trees and Astro Punk and Felix Jaeger 89 just subscribed. Thank, thank you. you. And uh, what was that name I was about to read? Gorlaroni. Oh, that's a fun name. And Inverted Bite and Every JB and Boo One on To You. And the Bat Pope and Raspberry Jazz and Small Crooked Fox and On the Men and Caffeine and Cake. Red Raven said Jacob, you look very handsome today. And Julia, you look beautiful as usual. Thank you. Julia's very cold. I'm in a big old blankie. It's cold in my apartment right now. It's certainly going to be colder in mine because I left the windows open. Like uh, a dingus. Planet Fiction asked, Jacob, you never fucking answered me, you cheapskate. If you jaywalk, do you call it Jacob walking? Yes. Now I will. From this moment forward. That's fair. Anywhere I walk, I'm Jacob walking. Mm -hmm. I don't have any other way of walking. Yeah. Uh, we're back with more later, alligator. That we are. We played this last Wednesday. Yes, because we didn't we, stream Sunday. We didn't stream Sunday. We actually entirely forgot yeah. that we were supposed to stream because we, we had the Draga Live show that day. Yeah. And we're very tired. We came home and just laid around because it was exhausting. Yep, it was like 10 o'clock at night and I looked over at Julie and I was like, oh, are we supposed to stream tonight? Oh, yeah. And she was like, whoops. Whoopsie doodles. <laughs> Uh-oh. Sorry, everyone. Whoops. <laughs> I think I just, like, groaned back. Yeah. Uh, thank you for the compliments on the live show. I hope you guys all enjoyed watching it on Monday if you did watch it. Yes. If you didn't watch it on the Dropout live stream, it's going to be going up on YouTube on Thursday. Right? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow yeah. is Thursday. Yeah, tomorrow is Thursday. I got an emote thanks to Jim Apple Baby's Mega Cheer. Whoa. Thank. Thank. Add a message to thank Jim Apple Baby for your gift. Um, I'm gonna add a message. Thank. <laughs> I'm sending thanks. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Great. I don't even know what that means. Does that mean that there's an emote in my emotes now because of this gift? What was it? Where is it? What was it? Where is it? What is it? Is there a... Oh, is it this one? Oh, it is. It's this one. It's that one. There it is. Thank you, Jim Apple Baby. <laughs> now we can use this little mage girl. Duel has resubscribed. Duel. Thank you. The queen. The queen. My queen. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Do you want to play the video game? Yes, please. Let's play the video game. I think you're playing the video game, but I want to see. But do you want to play game. it with me? Yeah. Last we left off, we were in the uh, bar, the sketchy bar, with a wonderful. Oh my god, I forgot. Yes, I we, just love everyone. We did in this the game. the whole anime dating sim mm -hmm. with the knife. Yes. And we talked to Big Pat or whatever his name is. Not Pat. Pat's the main character. What's um, his name? I have Tall to know. Jared. Tall Jared. Yeah. Yeah. Can we get a chocolate fountain? It's how much? Vigilante Jam, thank you for the sub. How about just a poster of one? Um, I love this friend in the middle that's just kind of sipping wine. This one. I love how. Should I love we how talk they to this just, one? Yeah, I love how they just turn. It's great. We're gonna talk to this one. Yes. It's Linda. I'm waiting for a blind date. So if you see anyone that looks like XX Gandalf Da Bay XX, let me know. I will let you know, Linda. They're tall, handsome, and a very successful lawyer, just like me. Mm -hmm. Linda, believe in yourself. That's what's important. You do you, Linda. Keep me posted, wingman. I would do anything for Linda. I love that Linda has teeth on... Uh, oh, who's I... that? Someone peeking out of the bathroom. Oh, oh, sippy cups. Click sippy cups. 
Sippy cups. Nice, Julia. Nice. Oh, I can also click only have one. I already did. Oh, it lights up. Oh. All right, we gotta talk to the bartender. Yeah, let's talk to the barkeep. You wanna be Terry? I've not seen you around here before. I think I'd remember a face like that. So distinct and clearly visible. We have the most visible face yep. in the game. What's a tall drink of water like you doing in a place like this? Trouser meddler subscribe. Wow. Said, love meeting y'all at NYCC. <laughs> nice meeting you. We loved meeting you too, probably. Thank you for not meddling with my trousers. Yeah. Which one were you, trouser meddler? Who were you? Who were you? Who were you? Put a face to the name. Everyone else here is uh, more a uh, middling half glass of yogurt top runoff. If you know what I mean. Sorry, all of those words were weird together. <laughs> Trouser Miller was Alice. It was great meeting you, Alice. Nice to meet you. Let's talk to this business guy. I loved your Alice cosplay. Clearly there. Clearly there. Thank you for the subscription. Thank you for the sub. Bobby Blue Eyes. What are you staring at, chump? Put those peepers away before I yank them out of your... Yank him clear out of your skull. What, you think you're a tough guy or something? <laughs> you think you can roll in here in a pinstripe suit not dissimilar to my own and share a passing glance with me? I mean, yeah, that's what I thought. Well, you've got another thing coming to you, pally, and it ain't nothing good. Around these parts, I'm the toughest guy you're gonna meet. So don't think you can slide into my bar and lock eyes <laughs> casually with me across the room. I love this animation so much. You'll be sorry when I pull those babies out and make them into twin gnocchis. I'll let you guess what the red sauce is, but you ain't gonna like it. Is it my blood? I just want to point out that I'm looking at like these still animations because mm -hmm. they're they're done like my news days. I was about to say they're not dissimilar to your squiggle vision. But there's they're three frames instead of oh. two. Every one of these still animations in this whole game was inked three times. Good God. Instead of two times. Can we acknowledge the shoulder pads on this gator? I always will acknowledge the shoulder pads. I'll always acknowledge the shoulder pads. Always. Always. Whom? The name's Bobby Blue Eyes, and don't you forget it, because it's going to be etched onto your tombstone. Wait, on your tombstone would be your name. My name would be... Hey! Just because I got confused about our societal rituals surrounding mortality doesn't mean you can look away. Do you want me to look at you or away from you, Look at him Bobby? with his little squishy cheek. We're having a good conversation here. Pat? <coughs> Pat? The little jabroni? <laughs> that little jabroni is my first cousin once removed. Can't wait to add you to the tree. Kinda like how I'm about to remove your eyes, <laughs> as I mentioned previously in the conversation. Minchuo Karina subscribed and said, I moved to the States so I can finally watch you live. Just so Great. you can watch us live? That's a really good reason to move to the States. I think you made a good choice. And Gorleroni subscribed. Thank you, Gorleroni. Thank you. And Mr. Gurgle subscribed. Wow. Said, hey, y'all, on anniversary vacation with my wife, Kate Monstar, so I get to be here for a live show. Stay wholesome, you guys. Nice. Glad you could be here, Mr. Gurgles, and happy anniversary. Happy anniversary to you and your wife. Do you think the red sauce thing was a little too far? And Duel of the Queen gifted a sub to Leprechaun Koala. Thank you. Thank you very much. Maybe it was a bit too far. I'm testing out a new tough guy material tonight, so it's a bit hit or miss. The event. Bobby ain't spilling family secrets. All right. <laughs> Unless. Oh, you want something, Bobby. You prove you're tough enough to me, the toughest guy in Alligator, New York City. I ain't gonna be easy, though. I don't make sure of that. So let you and me play a little game called Three Finger Filet. Or are you too chicken? I've never once been chicken. Mirror this cuckoo without getting a boo-boo. Knife to meet you. 
I'll play. Carefully watch how Bobby stabs the table. Copy his pattern on your side. Be careful to avoid your fingies. All right. I got my eyes on we you, only Bobby. We have three. Thringies. We only have three. You ready for this tough guy? Round one. Oh, I can do that. Yeah, yeah, easy peasy. No problem. Oh, yeah, I got that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, this song did that four times. Jam. That's impressive. I'm gonna turn the song up in stream so we can just jam for a minute. It's a damn jam. Going back down so I can game. <laughs> you got the Vin mm -hmm. Wonder Song move. Ah, uh, but how many more times do you think you could pull that off? A, a hundred more times. <coughs> Round two. Easy. <gasps> you have a knife now. One, two, three. It's like one, two, three. Oh, not even a problem. I'm a brain genius. I can memorize any pattern. Leprechaun Koala said, Just wanted to say that I love that you're playing this again. I got home from work about 15 minutes before the stream started, which is like two hours later than normal. Heart y'all so much. Thanks, Leprechaun Koala. Thank you very much. We're a big fan of this game. Not to say that games that we don't go back to we're not big fans of, but... Man, we were feeling this one. Wow, five times. Not bad. But let's up the ante a bit, shall we? Yeah, let's go, coward. <laughs> He's still using a spoon! Whoa, 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 what? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> that knife is terrif terrific, yes. Perfect for a tough guy. Uh, let's keep going. It's so big. It takes so long. Clearly there just asks, what kind of cat do you want to get, Julia? A nice one. That's it. It's my only requirement is that they let me hold them and play with them. Because cats don't like me very much. And that's a true fact. Not to say that they hate me, they're just really indifferent to me. I want to get an adult cat. Suck it, nerd. Hey, not bad, kid. Got all the way to six. I bet you think you're a real tough guy with those increasingly ludicrous knives you weirdly had in your personage. But check this out. Oh, I'm ready. Get ready. <laughs> oh no. No. Owie, my fingy. <laughs> ah. This with a spoon. Could you put a bandit on it, please? <laughs> Get ready. Band-aid. You got it, bud. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Gotta blow on it! Gotta blow on it! That's it. I don't want to play tough guys with you no more. You ruined it by going too far, and now look what happened. I may never play bass guitar again. <laughs> Big baby. Got a family member badge. Oh, jeez. Oh, You're a real tough customer. I'll give you that. The event is a happy thing, so leave those preposterous knives at home. Now go. Leave me with my band-aid and my misery. Oh, ouchie. 
Oh, poor buddy. No. I think that's it for this place. Yeah. I think we hit the exit button. And we go... Pomeranian, I told Jacob that if they had a black cat, I would take it. If it fitted, if it fitted us otherwise. If it fitted us. Because I usually only get um, black dogs because they are also not as easily taken. I'll take any cat. I'll take any kitty as long as they're nice. Goyles, goyles, goyles. All the goyles. Oh, how I love goyles. Every dog that I have had has been mostly black with a little bit of white. My first dog was a black lab. Rosalind Elsie Franklin was a British chemist and x-ray crystallography specialist. X-ray crystallography is the study of how beams of light move through various crystals and how the atoms inside are arranged. She presented a seminar on the structure of DNA molecule and later captured a photo of x-rays moving through crystallized DNA. Without these two contributions, we wouldn't know the structure of DNA, the building block of all living things. Can we acknowledge that this was what the girls, girls, girls was pointing to? This is to? what all the girls are doing down here. This is dope as hell. Rosalind was raised in a family of activists. She had an aunt and an uncle deeply involved in the women's suffrage movement in Britain, and her parents helped resettle Jewish refugees who had escaped from the Nazis. Even as a kid, she was an excellent scholar and attended one of the few girls' schools in London that taught math and physics. She attended University at Cambridge, where she met Adrian Whale, a French scientist and a former student of Marie Curie. Marie Curie was famous for discovering radium and polonium, and was also a pioneer in the field of x-rays. In 1951, a young Dorothy Crowfoot would road trip with her classmates to see Rosalind Franklin's groundbreaking DNA molecule seminar. The same Dorothy Crowfoot, Hodgkins, would later use x-ray crystallography to map the structure of insulin. So these are just real ladies that they're talking about. Yeah, but alligator <clears throat> versions. This is an impressive lineage of scientific women mentoring women, and that's so awesome! The two scientists who presented the completed structure of the DNA molecule, the double helix, used Rosalind's unpublished data to correct their original model. Without Rosalind's calculations and her lab photos of crystallized DNA, we wouldn't have modern molecular biology. Rosalind Franklin deserves credit for building our understanding of genetics and how everything living is made. We got a puzzle piece! Oh, jeez! Apparently, according to Nugget Maver, every time you come back, they have a talk uh, about a whole bunch of different super cool ladies from history. Oh, that's great. That's awesome. I love how this girl is in a different font. Um, I... Uh, relate to the one that's sitting by the cookies. This one? Yeah, that's me. Uh, let's see, which one is me? Honestly, this one. Yeah. I'm like watching, but I'm not taking notes. I'm just kind of yeah. like taking it all in. Yeah. But I am being very patient. Yeah, you're just sitting there. Yeah. Like, nice and politely. Yeah. <laughs> this book's called Wow, and this one's called We. <laughs> wow, we. See if there's anything to click. All right, we got lots of people to talk to in here. Wow, what's the what's the time on our watch say? I know that that says it's five to two, but one thirty. Hmm. Should we talk to Cookie Monster? Hell yeah, it's me. Welcome. Please sign our guest book. Okay. And sign here for our mailing list. Okay. And sign here too, right there. Great. I really needed a co-signer for my small business loan. Default and Gail, that's what they call me down at the credit union. <laughs> Gail, you have some problems you need to work on. <laughs> sign the guest book, or don't. Go your own way, baby. Okay, so Gail's done. I wanna to talk to me. Yeah, talk to you. I've attended advocacy talks all up and down the East Coast, but this one by far has the best lemon square and brownie selection. <laughs> He's in it for the snacks. Ranch, ranch, ranch. Do I have time to get another Rice Krispie treat before we continue? Climate change is real. I mean, <laughs> Teddy talking the truth. <laughs> Teddy, damn, spitting truth. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> joke there. It just is. <laughs> just gotta slip that in there. Gotta slip that in. Let's talk to this one. Teddy talking facts. Sal. Oh, this is all so affirming. I'm approaching max validation. Makes me want to strut right out of here and start a revolution. I feel you. The Sal revolution begins today. You go, Sal. Yes, yes, I agree. Ha, thank you, Sal. Good to see you back again. Oh, I had a Oh my goodness. I can't believe Katie knows my name. The Sal revolution is going great. I got a puzzle piece. Oh yeah. E Let's talk to this one. Caro. Hey, you know beloved movie franchise Space Fight, Episode 7, Return of the Guy? Yeah. Remember when Banigan Cloud It's Bananagan. Bananagan Cloud Pincher is revealed to be the guy? I just feel like people really misunderstood his character. So he did some space murder, so he punched a baby so hard it turned into a diamond. If people would only seek out the extended content, they'd see there's so much more to him. A real space flight fan reads the 45 companion novels, played the ARG, and collected enough box tops to send away for the compendium. Do you know how much cereal I ate for that? I'm banned from the Brodega now. <laughs> Well, also because I keep paying for apples and pennies. Space fight. Space fight. Space fight. Space fight. Let's talk to this fucking Jess. Do, do goody good. Five eleven. Thank you so much for the drawing of Scout that you sent me. It's hanging oh, up. Oh man, the desk. yeah, it's so good. Everyone thought it was a photo. Yeah, I like had to look really close and then I like held it up to be like, is it a drawing? Yeah. It's so, so, so good. Yeah. If y'all awesome want to see word. it, it's on my Twitter. Yeah, go look at Julia's Twitter. Uh, right now. Yes. Excuse me, I'm clearly trying to take notes on the material, so shoo. Cassandra, with every beat of my heart I long for you. Douglas wittered, his flippers padding across the ballroom to meet her. His lavender orb sparkled with unspoken love for her totally slamming bod and personality. Hey! Stop looking over my shoulder! It is healthy to express yourself creatively! That's true. A lot of good lessons in this, uh... Yeah! This girls, girls, girls meeting. This girls, girls, girls meeting knows where it's at. Ayush! Am I in the wrong room? This is definitely not a support group for people who have grown too emotionally attached to vloggers. <laughs> That's where all you guys need to go watching this stream. <laughs> <laughs> I... I should leave before anyone notices. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. <laughs> We love you guys, too. You can't yeah. take back the sub. It's too late. It's ours now. <laughs> it's a good goof. It's all, we love you guys. It's all love. It's all, it's all, it's love. all love. Actually, it's pretty interesting. I bet they have better coffee than the support group, too. I'm good enough. I'm smart enough. And gosh darn it. I'm worth vlogging about. Hell yeah, Ayush. Hell yeah, Ayush. You are worth vlogging about. Alright. Hey, Emily. Yeah. You want to go get sushi burritos after this? I know we're trying to save money, but I hear the siren song of Sushrito calling me. You had me at hey. The fusion of two star-crossed foods, and so different from each other, and yet so delicious as one. I wonder what other Thai star combos or cuisine we're missing. Like ships in the night. Pasta sickles. Uh. Quiche za. Well. A burger, but it's tacos. Two tacos. 
Okay, that one I'm vaguely interested in. Hey, Emily. Hey, Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Do we finally talk to Katie? Yeah. Beep! Oh, I was high-pitching her, right? Yeah. Ooh, someone new! Was that the voice? I don't think so. I don't remember what it was. Have a seat! We're just about to get started. Glad you could make it to the stream, Blumber. Welcome, Blumber. Welcome, Blumber, to the stream. Help yourself to some coffee or some Minna's famous spring rolls. Oh, I forgot what I did for Minna. Oh, go on. <laughs> I made her worse. <laughs> yeah, see? Don't worry about where you sit. I plan on yelling indiscriminately, so all seating is within range. Cyblin! Thank you, Cyblin. Thank you for the sub. Did I put enough folding chairs? Don't want a repeat of Space Fight to be a night's chaos. Right, Can I you guess sit that's... in that chair right there? No. no. I think right, that's I it that's for, it for girls, girls, girls. I'm glad we came here to learn some good facts about... And meet some good ladies! About some rad historical women. But it's time for me to go. Um, I think. I think we're done I here. Think we're done here. Yep. All right. So we were in the fun district. Before. Yes. So we're in the unsavory part of town. And there's downtown. So I picked unsavory. So I think it's your your pick. I tried to click to the bathroom, but it couldn't. Everyone's saying bathroom? No, the bathroom in the bar. The bathroom in the bar? Yeah, with the eyeballs. I tried to click that. Uh, this is. Oh no, the, we have facts. The lessons oh no, are we have good. real facts. The lessons are good, but I have to click the bathroom. Clicking the bathroom is my most important. Oh no. I love what you're telling me, but also I have to go use the bathroom. This is all super cool. Everyone, go back, watch the VOD. Mm -hmm. Okay, not this bathroom. This bathroom is unclickable. This bathroom is unclickable. I was pretty sure I clicked the bar's bathroom as well. But I'll try again. Yeah, bathroom is unclickable. Bathroom's nothing. What is wrong with all of you? Everyone's screaming bathroom. I can't go in any bathroom. Leave! I thought you guys had facts. Leave. But you had fictions. Wow. You came at me with fictions. I'm jibated. <laughs> ah! Nope. Nothing. Brown Town said, listen, maybe we just all have to shit, okay? <laughs> Chat needs a bathroom break. All right, Alligator Memorial Park or downtown? I'm going downtown. All right. Oh, look at that gator on the bike! That's the gator I want to be. The bike gator. <gasps> oh, hey. Hey, <laughs> you're really looking right at me, huh? <laughs> really just staring right at me. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I love everyone in this scene. I sell bug! I sell bug. Yeah, give me that. Nana Pines. Give me that. I sell bug. I sell bug! The thing a lot of people don't realize is I sell bug. Oh! Oh, they said hello! hello. Alright, I'm gonna talk to Card Gator. Okay. Sleepy pants. <laughs> Mm. Alright, I guess they're just asleep. Zzz, man, I'm so totally asleep right now. Zzz, I love being asleep. Zzz. Zzz. Let's talk to this fancy lad. Yeah. Do you want to voice him or shall I? Jorge! The Breeze, the practicing quartet, 
What a perfect day to be a live alligator. Even though it gets noisy sometimes, I love living in the city. It's so full of life and good burger joints. Mood. Ah, I'm so content. Barbershop Quartet? Yep. Denise. Hello. 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 Hey. <laughs> oh, hello. We're, We're the downtown, downtown quartet, quartet, and, and we'll, we'll sing, sing you a song. song. It's not, not a very short one, one, but it also ain't long. long. We'll, we'll sing it in the morning, and we'll sing it past noon. We've, We've had, had a lot of noise complaints, and we'll be gone soon. Hit the solo, Maurice. To jail. <laughs> Thank you, Runzabusha. Runzabusha. Can I just say I'm glad that we both understood that we needed to read that in unison? Yeah. Uh, yeah, we got that down pat. Just, we knew it in our hearts that that was true. Mm -hmm. Whom? Denise. Luis. Patrice. Maurice. Pat? We're, We're Pat's, Pat's aunt and uncles. And he's, he's our, our darling nephew. nephew. All, All except for Luis, Luis who's, who's just, just part, part of the crew. Oh Take it, it, Luis. Oh, yeah. I'm Maurice. I'm sorry. Totes the plaid. Thank you for the sub. Oh, baby, I'm not related to Pat. No, nothing like that. I'm just a guy they know that takes part in the show. Oh, oh. Oh, dude, pull back. Sorry. The event. We, we can't, can't tell, tell you much, much but, but we'll, we'll sing, sing like a bird. bird. If, if you can help, help us with our act, we'll, we'll tell, tell you all that we heard. I can't wait for the barbershop quartet to be done. Give them a solo without triggering an oh no. Oh boy. Barbershop upset. Help the alligator quartet hit their solos. When the scrolling bar shows the singer's background, point the spotlight at them. Rhythm game! Let's first warm up our vocal cords. Keep an eye on the scrolling bar at the bottom. Shine the spotlight at the singer with the matching background. When the groovy disco pattern appears, shine the spotlight at the disco ball, and we'll all sing together. Ready, gentlemen? Ready, maestro? What? Oh, I see. So it's a disco ball, then... Who are you? Oh, you have to hit the person. Who are you? Oh. You have to put the spotlight on the person, not the wall. I thought it was the wall. No. Salty Dalty and Shadow Maiden subscribed. Dang it, I was doing it wrong. All right, I'll turn the volume up. Since I did an oopsie. Because it shows wallpaper. It does. On the bar. All right, go for it. Jacob, that's Mott Jow Spotlights, Warwick. <laughs> You're right, made to chat. You're all right. Yeah, I, I got it. I got it. It's hard to tell. Yeah, I'm wondering because one of them is green and it is kind of close to the gray one. 
It's well, this one and this one are the ones I have a hard time with. Yeah, that's the green one is all the way on the left, and that one's the gray one on the right. Uh, they both look a hundred percent gray to me. Yeah. Okay. I've got it this time. <gasps> I could have had more timbre. Timbre? Come on. It's a singing word. I'm a real singer and I'm gonna prove it. Okay, okay. Last time. Alright, everyone. Give it everything you've got. <laughs> Colors are very muted. Yeah, they're very muted and it's gray, <laughs> green, and pink, which are all very similar at yeah. both saturations. Turn the volume back down a bit. We got a family member badge. Everyone keeps thinking that I'm one of the voice actors for. The singers. <laughs> it's because it kind of sounds like <laughs> something like you would do. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, right. Sorry. You helped us with, with our, our song and to improve, improve our content. content. Now, now what, what we're, we're gonna, gonna tell you is we're booked, booked at the event. event. Thanks, Thanks for all your help. help. Now, now we'll see you in a wink. Unless we get, get arrested, arrested, then please spring, spring us from the clink. Thank you, Barbershop Quartet. Hello, hello. Your pal, the city aficionado here. I just wanted to make sure you know about this cool local place called the Nana Roo's Antiques. The one right across from me? Yeah. I know what you're thinking. Antiques are for grandmas. Hey! And you're right. The whole shop is run by a grandma. Well, a Nana. Nana Roo. I love antiques. There's a great local legend about the place. That it's super haunted by like five billion ghosts. What's really haunting, though, is the prices. RFL. Ha. Huh. Just a little shopping humor for me to you. I'm not really rolling on the floor. Anyway, Nanaru is a much uh, card shark, and she is a deal shark, so be careful. But if you have time, defo check out her colorful shop. It's tons of fun. I'm gonna do that. I have to talk to I Sell Bug first. Do you want a voice? Papuli! Do you want a voice, Papuli? Bugs! Bugs for sale! More than one, even, unlike what the sign implies. Yeah, I sell bugs here. Oh no, not for baiting, for eating. We're alligators and we eat bugs, which is something you know because you exist here, canonically. Anyway, get bug buying or good buying, kiddo. I ain't got all day. Because I gotta sell bugs to feed my family with different bugs, which I buy with an alligator currency. Whom? Most people call me Papuli, but my real name is Mortimer Giles Jr. the third and a half. On account of my grandfather being perfectly bisected by a wheat thresher during the Great Depression. Good lord. Miraculously, he survived, but his life wasn't without its problems, such as how it was hard to see him when he turned directly to the side. 
Gampa, where are you, we'd call. But to no avail, he'd already slipped through a crack in the decorative linoleum. It's the last time we ever saw him, and also when those basement sounds started up. <laughs> but look at me rambling here to a youth about cellar screams and the like. Eh, did you say Pat? That's my grandson's name. But also the name of the nurse that comes to massage the kinks out of my tail on Tuesdays. Did you mean Pat or Pat? You'll have to speak up. I'm out of here and due to a condition where I stop listening mid-sentence and think about the war. <laughs> oh no. Oh boy. Eh? Event? I'm not quite sure what you're talking about. I have a selective memory disorder, you see, and that I forget about things I don't really want to go to. I have that. Perhaps you could jog this old man's memory if you help me out with a favor. You see, the only photo I have left of my dear late wife Martha has also been the victim of a wheat thresher incident. <laughs> my god, stay away from wheat thrashers! I can't seem to put it back together again. Oh, wow, I'd give anything to see Martha's sweet smile again. Can't help this old softy gaze upon his lost love once more. I can't wait to see what Martha is. Get the pieces glued for this old dude. Make my wife, please. Oh my god. Click a block to slide it into the empty space. Reassemble the picture to gaze upon this alligator's beautiful wife. It's a goddamn slide puzzle. I'm horrible at slide puzzles. I can't believe they've done this to me. Joe and Conrad, I know you're not here tonight, but I can't believe you've done this to me personally. Do you want me to do it? Are you better at slide puzzles? I'm... Oh. Oh. I always just end up clicking randomly until it happens to work. I mean, you could do that. Nugget Maber says, if you take too long, it will let you autofill, so you don't get trapped forever. Mostly very tired, just subscribed. Thank you. Um, Conrad Cat, who is not Conrad, uh, is here. But is a Conrad. You're not a Conrad, Conrad, so I guess. Mountain Ash Tree has subscribed. Thank you very much. I just... They're the worst. They're the worst puzzles known to man. How does anyone do it? How does anyone do it? Alright, you want me to get the top... Get the top, middle, and top right. <laughs> so much I don't think it's relevant anymore. Bloodshot Gay gifted a tier one sub. Thank you. <coughs> just... The chat is saying they believe in you. Don't. Don't believe in me and this time. And also that they agree with you on slide puzzles. Cause it's like I can get some but then everything's all messed up and jacked up and hecked up. Do you want me to try? Yeah, yeah, you take it. You do clicks. I do clicks. This is just gonna make me sad and angry. Okay. Thank you for the bits, Jade Iferous, but I'm not doing amazing, and I think we all agree with that. The Lonely Wolf said, <laughs> looks like you're not very good at this. Oh, yeah, there it is. Should we just do that so that we can just leave? I, I would prefer to. Okay. We did it! <laughs> That's it! That's my Martha! Oh, lovely dear Martha. I'll always remember the sound of a sweet voice in her. Oh dear, it seems you've seen the other side now with my secret wife. What? Could you put this one back together too? If not for me, then for creepy old coot grandpas everywhere. Go for it, Julia. How are there more pieces on the backside of the existing pieces? I literally <laughs> could not tell you. Okay. 
Oh my god. <laughs> you okay? At least the, this game, you know, lets you stop after a while. That's true. Um... I've played so many games where you can't stop. That's true. It's not the best. Okay. Listen, E. Gray A. It's not polyamory if it was a secret wife. That's true. If his other wife knew about it and was cool about it. What's the next piece that I'm looking for? This one? No. This one? Is it this one? I have no idea. Don't ask me. Where's the top of his sleeve here? Oh, it's this. It goes on top. That's all I'm looking for right now. Oh, wait, there it is. Apparently, there's uh, Seven Lizards in a Code is just saying, just wait for what it actually is. I'm excited to find out someday. Someday. See, you get like so much of it done, and then you have to undo it. It's like a Rubik's Cube. Cacti Doggo subscribed. Thank you, Cacti Doggo. I think the rule is like you have to figure out the corners first or something. Can I also say I hate Rubik's Cubes? Oh, I can solve a Rubik's Cube. I think they're infuriating. And it's like, if you know how to solve it already, then you can solve it. Mm hmm But how many people actually like figure it out on their own and how many people just look up how you solve it and then do it? I had someone tell me. That's everyone I've ever known that has solved one is because they, someone told them how to solve it. But then it's like a fun thing in cooperation, you know what I mean? But then it's like, it's a bad puzzle if no one ever solves it on their own. Yeah. Julia did get me turned on to some like pick cross puzzle though, puzzles though. Mm -hmm. On like mobile apps. I like those. I like the pick cross puzzles. Well, because those you can figure out because they're all logic based. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like if I'm doing bad, then it's my fault. Right. That's not what I wanted. Just give me this. I'm playing the app called Picture Cross. Oh my god. What's the one you're playing? I don't know what it's called. You don't know what it's called? No. It's good though. Unbelievable. We got the badge. We won. Oh, Gertie, good old Gertie. It's been years since I've looked upon your sweet curly hair and your man breaking arms. Thank you so much for your help, stranger. Thanks to you, I'm reunited with both my lost loves. Martha passed years ago, but Gertie is just in witness protection. You know, from all the man breaking. Amazing. That's why it's a secret wife. Yeah. What a firecracker, that gal. On cold days, I can still feel the phantom broken body pain she left me. Eh? Event? Oh, you mean tonight's event? Well, I can tell you it's on past my bedtime. You young folk got love... You, you young folks... You folks... You young folks love staying up late. You young folks, you love staying up late. Me, I'm in bed by six nightly after a modest dinner of soft bug puddings and four to seven episodes of soft flutes on public broadcast. Hell yeah. I'm gonna watch that in a second. Anyway, kiddo, thanks again for helping me out. Or should I say helping three out? Hey. Hey. Oh my god. Don't tell my grandkids. I'm too New York. That's what just happened. Yep. Hey. All right, we going into this antique shop or what? We gotta. We simply got it. <gasps> oh, there's friends everywhere here. Oh, this is my favorite place so far. I'm also oh. loving this kid that's popping up at the bottom. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I gotta make sure that I'm clicking all the things I need to click. Chandelier. So swords. Babushkas. Oh, I almost said babushka dolls. I think everyone almost says babushkas. But I that's think there was another on, uh, in the matrushkas. No. On the right. No. And the up. No. Okay, never mind. No. What you're saying to me is it was lies. Just lingered. You're saying lies to me. Let's talk to this old bag. It's Nanaru! Welcome to 
banana rouge where if there's ooze on your shoes, it's just cause of the booze. It's on it all. Get out in here, sweetheart. So mind the ectoplasm. So, you interested in buying some antiques from me today, Dollface? We just got in a huge new shipment of designer grandma plates, never meant to be eaten all. As well as a bunch of confusing teddy bears from the 70s with realistic plastic faces. <laughs> I hate those things. I hate them too. I can get you a real deal on one of those, if that's your fancy. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your fancy? I know you kids are into weird stuff these days. I want that Victrola behind her. Yes, sir. I see you over there. I'll be with you in a minute. You already have the most haunted ass record player I've ever heard. I don't know what you need more for. You know that's going into our new apartment, right? I can't wait for you to crank it up in the middle of the night so I can play it. It's <laughs> just the most haunted sounding records I've ever heard. That's because I didn't wind it up all the way. It sounds good when you wind it up all the way. Everything you put in it sounds like... It's from like 1930. It's so scary. It's very <laughs> rad though. I love it. Boom! Well, sugar pie, as a sign may have alerted you, I'm the one and only Nana Rue herself. Purveyor of only the finest antique goods and the finest antique store owners. <laughs> Go on, honey, tell me I'm looking good for my age. You're looking good for your age. Alice, stop harassing the customers. Pat? My sweet, sweet Patrick. He's my absolute shortest grandson. Why, well, it feels like only yesterday. He would run around the shop squealing about ghosts trying to eat his kidneys and hiding in the humorously oversized faces. What, what would Jedi, Jedi do? do? You for the sub? Or as I like to call them, what would Jadito? Did we shout out Cock the Doggo? I did. Thank you. Also, I feel like we should both know that Big Gamer 1289 has followed. Oh, damn. Big, so, the Big Gamer. The Big Gamer themselves is here. As you could probably tell by my expression, that actually was yesterday. That boy may not be playing with a full deck. You! Hey, you! Be careful with that vase! It's expensive! The event. Oh, so Pat's inviting his little friends to the event. Isn't that cute? Or he's just such a darling, that boy. Asriel Sinclair, thank you for the sub. Thank you, Asriel Sinclair. I'll be closing the shop early to get over there on time tonight. Gotta strain all the ghosts out of my wig before the shindig, you know? Those things tend to hitch a ride. Yes, sir, I see you there. I'll be with you in a minute. Sorry, pumpkin. Looks like I have to stop yapping about the event and take care of a customer. Unless you defeat me in a round of cards. What'd you say, sweetheart? Think you can out-old the old maid? Uh, I'm only just remembering the thing that we recorded today. And Karina drawing a card game. <laughs> it's very good. We recorded a Draw Detectives today. Yay! We're back, baby! I hope you are ready for a lot of very good Nathan laughs. Really, Three Kids in a Trench Coat is preparing to have surgery next week. Good oh, luck. Good luck, three kids in a trench coat. Good luck. Although Draw Detectives 4 is, hasn't has it come out yet? It's scheduled to go on dropout this Saturday. Draw Detectives 4? Yeah. Hell yeah! And we recorded five today. We're doing good. Yeah. Not five episodes. We recorded episode five. Episode five. Episode five has a lot of really good Nathan laughs. On your turn, click to take one of Nana Rue's cards. Then she'll take one from you. Any matching pair will be removed player left holding the old maid loses. Let's go. Jacob's have, helping me with the audio edit on the, the latest draw tactics because we're also doing a news day that requires me to draw in a style that's just the worst to mimic. Give me this one. Yeah, give me this one. 
Oh, baby. That cup of pens says, my pen. Do you want to read this dialogue? I've had so many pens, they should call me the matchmaker. <laughs> Sometimes it feels like the pens want to find me. Give me... Nervous? You still have a card to pick. Give me this one. Oh no! Good it's the bad card! It's the old maid! You might not know, but this is my lucky pick and flipper. I used my unlucky pick and flipper. Oh, she almost took it back. I knew today would be a lucky oh, day. Oh no! Ah oh, ha ha! I have a feeling you'll have a good pick this time. Come on. Yeah! I'll get you next turn, I know it. You better get what that old face? maid. You might not know it, but this is my lucky picture. I do know work. it. Get the old maid. Yes! yes! You dumb broad! Go on, take your pick. No! Take it back. No! Boy, I'm getting tired of looking at that old maid. Come on! I like the look of this guy. Take mm -hmm. it back. Damn it. Another pair for me. Oh no. Nervous? You still have to pick a card. You're holding the old maid. That's some luck you got there. Oops. Half rules. The younger player goes first. Give me this one. Give me this one. That's right. That's a pair. One more pair for you. Take whatever you wish. Old bag. I think today would be a lucky day. Give me this one. Ah, it's the old maid! There she goes! Get away from me, old maid! Oh my god, Grandma! Give me the middle one. Mr. Ronio just subscribed. Yeah, get the old maid. Get the old You! 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 I'm gonna get stuck with it again! Yeah, you are! That's some luck you got there! I can't retry?! No, you already retried! It wasted 15 minutes! Time to get your losses, sweetheart! No one can out on me! I think is what it's saying. Hey, it's me again, Pat! It's almost four and I could really use your help! I'm coming back here. Do you know anything about shoes? And the, the wearing of them, Theron? Couple of things. Perfect! Can you come meet me at my hotel room? Mike, uh, one. Subscribe. Thank you, Mike. Uh, one. Just make sure you aren't followed by any shifty characters. The only shifty characters is cheating ass grandma. Or college age canvassers in cargo shorts. I already gave all my dollar bills to that guy pretending to be a statue outside Fourth Street. I'm on my way. Look at this fella. Hey, bud. That was one of the arms in the air. <laughs> I am gonna come back. I'm gonna go back there as soon as I'm done Ooh. dealing with Pat's dumb shit. <gasps> me! Me! Did you see the waiter in the back? Good evening to you, fellow traveler. Have you come to imbibe some ales after your long journey as well? Garçon, fetch us your finest novelty wine based on a popular sci-fi television show. Tanilla, thank you for the sub. Alligator fun, I'm in, is what Tanilla said. Nice suit. I like dabbing in a little bit of cosplay myself. Why, just last year at Alligator Comic Con, I dressed as a character of my own creation. Derelis, great wizard of the north! My brother Mickey helped me put it together, though he did get it a bit slimy. Ooh. I'm Derry, known as the terror of the east side in most Magic's The Happening card game circles. <laughs> oh my god! On campus, I'm known as a terror of the AP Biolab, or the one with that haircut. Oh, jeez. 
Pat is my second cousin, as well as my second favorite person to play Dungeons and Dragons with. Isn't this an anime character where he has a bowl cut and everyone's like, haha, you have a bad bowl cut, and then it turns out that he's just like the best at everything? What are you talking about? There's some anime character where I'm thinking about that. You're thinking about Mob? No. The first being my internet friend Carl, whose dad got rich bitcoin mining. Pat's a bard, so you know, pretty party useless. Great singing voice, though. He can really wail on that juice harp. Maybe it was Mob. Yeah, it's a party. What, am I not supposed to say that? It's really spilled the beans, Dairy. Huh? You're leaving already? Well, safe travels, my fellow traverser of the mortal plane. Perhaps we'll meet again in another realm or in the internet forum for role-playing. Oh boy. Look at the guy at the back. Salutations and good morrow. Look at him. <laughs> Hello, esteemed guest. Mr. Pat asked me to inform you to come straight to his hotel room upon arrival. <laughs> All the bard fans in chat are screaming at Derry. <laughs> He also asked me to warn you to knock first in case he's wearing pants. But not to say that second part aloud. Kind of forget what I just said and come with me. I'll walk you to Mr. Pat's room at once. Let's go! If you'd be so kind as to click and drag along the hallway, we should arrive shortly. Oh my, how embarrassing. Please don't tell the internet we've got biohazard incident. And... Thank you for your patience, esteemed guests. We've now arrived. Mr. Pat is expecting you. Please knock in case he's... I have a Johnny of the day! <laughs> Welcome back! I was just trying on some pa- Nothing. Uh, I wasn't doing anything, actually. S so, have you talked to more of my family? Found out any secret plans? You think they're th throwing me out? No, no. You're, you're totally wrong about that. I would definitely know if they were doing that. Plus, it sounds a little far-fetched, don't you think? You can't pull one over on old Pat on his birthday! That's what I always say. Well, I say it sometimes, like, once a year. No way. They're definitely putting together some systematic plan to end my moderate to small life. But I appreciate you putting in the thought. Maybe if you talk to a few more people, you'll find out something we can really use. In the meantime, though, I actually called you because I need your help. You see, I'm having a problem. A shoe-related problem. I don't usually wear them. But I figured if I did tonight, maybe I'd have better luck hot-footing it out the event safely if I need to. The issue isn't my shoelace, pantsless nature, but the drawers where I actually keep all my things. Last week, my Nana Roo gifted me an antique armoire from her shop as an early birthday present. It's big, spacious, practical, and so super haunted that it's leaving a weird stain on the parquet flooring just by existing. That's parquet. Parquet! You're a French dog. <laughs> yeah, I thought he would say parquet. I haven't been able to wear any of my shoes, and whenever I open a drawer, weird stuff happens. Here, why don't you see for yourself? Peruse for shoes! Soul searching. Find a pair of Pat's favorite shoes by clicking on these suspicious drawers. Be careful, if Pat gets too scared, he'll give up on shoes forever. Oh boy. After each round, the contents of the drawers will shuffle around. Spooky! If it's luck based, I'm fuck based. Based on my performance in Old Maid. Help me find my shoes, please. Round one. So it's none of the top ones. Well, that one has a shoelace sticking out of it. This one? Yeah. 
Nope. No, that's a that's a candle that melts. I apologize. Eyeball's got nothing. Nothing. Oh, a shoe! Oh, yeah! Good job! Hey! A shoe! Let's find the other! It's Ono Mo's first live stream! Welcome. Welcome to the live stream. Glad you're here. Help me find these shoes. That's a ghost. That's a ghost. That's a shoe. They don't go together. Hey! A shoe! Let's find the other! That's a shoe! Hey! A shoe! Let's find the other! You found the oh, other one a, of that dog? It's a matching game. I thought there was one in there. There we go. Yeah. Great! We made a pair! Round two. Alright, it's Five. all gonna shuffle around now. No shoe. No! Oh, spooky! That's a ghost! That's a shoe! That's a shoe! Alright, help me remember. Hey, a shoe. There's a shoe yeah. in the cracked one. Yeah. That's nothing. That's nothing. That? That's nothing. That's oh, full of bugs. bugs! Get that guy in here. That's, That's a, shoe. a shoe. All right, there's a shoe in this one. That's a ghost. That's a ghost. You pulled that one already. That one. That's oh. a monster. That's a, That's shoe. a shoe. That one goes, with, goes the with the other, other one. one. Yay! Yeah. Oh, there were toe shoes. All right, round three. We got this. I've all can't, I've all three times in a row. Can't That's be gross stuff. Damn it! That's a ghost. That's a shoe! That's a shoe. So we know diamond handle at the top. That's the melty candle. That's the shoe! They're right next to each other! It's a shoe! Yeah! It's all a shoe! Sunny skies ahead at the first live stream. Sunny skies ahead, glad you could make it to your first live stream. Welcome. It's also every JB's first live stream, and they demanded validation. Wow, welcome. So you got it. You have validation. Welcome now. to the yam stew. You are valid. You are a part of the stew. We are all a part of the stew. We're each but a yam floating in a stew. I can't believe it. You found all three pairs of shoes that I own. Every shoe kind of represented here. Brown, sneaky, and tropical. You know, looking at them now is kind of giving me performance anxiety, actually. Maybe I should just go bear flipper like I usually do. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just so nervous. I'm not thinking straight. I'm sorry I made you come all the way back here for nothing, but I really did appreciate it. I like how you just kind of freestyle these sentences a lot of the time. Yeah, it's fine. It still works. Yeah, I you get just the like, You just it. like to do it your own way. Yeah. I'm so glad we met today. You're the best pal I've had in a long time. <laughs> I'm getting all mushy. You get back out there and dig up more dirt, and I'll text you just before... Mm -hmm. Event. See you later, investigator. I'm going back. I got a date with Nana Ru. Do the the family tree. Do I'll the do family, the family tree. tree. Welcome to Johnny John's. Would you like to hear today's specials? No. Oh, it's this guy, Charlene. Yeah. Oh boy, company. Give me a moment. It's gonna oh, take some time right. to rouse my polite small talk face. This is the one that didn't want to talk to us. I'm just enjoying two or eight cups of coffee here at the bar. Bub tries to stop filling my mug after four, but I know his weakness. Strangulation. <laughs> Don't talk to me before I've had my coffee. Or before noon, or at night, or on weekends, and weekdays. Essentially, don't talk to me. Hmm. Alright, let's, do the, let's do the family tree. Family tree. Yeah. I'm actually strong against strangulation. Oh my, you're back already. Why, hello again, dear. Did you manage to take any family photos? You know I did. You know that I did. I'm almost doing my, my Barbie voice for her. I'm a Barbie voice. In a Barbie blam blam blam. Okay, we got a lot. We got a lot. Is Majima related? I forget. 
I forget a lot of this. Okay, this is his so, grandfather. Yeah, that's grandpa. That's Grampers. That's Grampers. Okay, next one. That's Grampers. Oh, on the other side, huh? That's Grampers. Okay. Papuli! Oh, because the antiques old lady is also his grandma. No, that's his nana. His nana. Which is Is grandma. that a grandma? Yeah. But I don't have her thing because she bested me. Oh, that's right. Where does this guy go? Here? Over here? Over here? Oh, yep. wow. Aiden. Aiden, stinky alley man and part-time dumpster diver. Because he's like with someone. These were cousins. Where do cousins go? Here? Yes. Oh, no, come back. Cousins. No, come back. Cousins. Come back. You're saying that like uh, Sailor Moon says cousins, and I appreciate cousins. that. Cousins. Cousins? Cousins. Cousins? Cousins. Cousins? Oh, they were aunts and uncles. They're not cousins. You lied to me. I wasn't paying attention. What? You weren't paying attention? That's not... <laughs> to the stream? Julia. You shame yourself. Wouldn't it go like... Ah, got it. Got Denise. Good job. All right, Denise. Was she married to one of these guys? Yeah. Yeah. Married to Patrice, Denise and Patrice. Oh my God, Denise and Patrice had rad. Had person. Joni. Yeah, Joni, rad person. Joni. Joni, rad person. Uh, okay. Check the sewer in front of Nana Rue's antique shop. Okay. Someone wasn't related. This guy wasn't related. Shop, of Luis was not related. So he probably just goes on one of these, maybe. Is he related to the the cute little girl? Oh, Aww. he is. Luis. He's a cute little daughter. This guy was a cousin. Derry. Was Derry a cousin? Sure. Cousin Derry. Cousin Derry? Yes! Yeah! Nervous, Nervous Dairy. Dairy. Conspiracy theory, YouTuber. No! Nervous no. Dairy, you suck! No! No! Where does Tall Jared go? I hope Yeah. He oh, Wait, yeah! Yeah. yeah. Tall Jared and Joni are, are siblings? Sibl yeah, siblings. Oh my god, what a beautiful world we live in here. Oh, this guy was a was an uncle. This guy was a dunkle. This guy was a yeah, drunkle. Maurice. Uh, okay, who are, what about these rich ones? What were the rich ones? Cousins? Were they cousins? Rich cousins? Oh. Yeah. Rich cousins. Rich cousins. What's in that one commercial? All right, where does Majima go? Majima! Is he their, is he their sibling? <laughs> is he just a guy? I think he's just a guy? Oh, he's just a guy. He's just a guy. The knife. All right, all we have left is, uh, what's his name? Good Eyes Greg. Yeah. Who was, uh, cousin? <laughs> Uncle? Everyone's a cousin. Cousin! Just some guy? He's an uncle, right? I think so. Gram that would be a Gramp grandfather. Grampers? Cousin. That that would be a... Uncle. Yeah, that would be uncle. Cun crunkle. There yeah. we go. Yeah! Bobby Blue Eyes. Very busy. Very cool business guy. We got it, baby. Good We're job. filling out the old family tree. All right. I uh, guess... Go back. I'm the... going back. Okay. I'm gonna bust that old lady's ass. I'm gonna break up all the stuff in her shop. Teach her to play old maid with me like that. Wow, uh, you're angry phoning. Yep. All right, you're gonna have to check the sewer. Cause someone said check the sewer. It just makes makes Hello. it say hi. It just makes it say hi. Hello. 
It's the Lonely Wolf 2115 stream. First stream. It's not their stream. It's our stream. It's our stream. But it's but their welcome. first stream. So that's that's cool and important. Welcome. What's also cool and important is winning at Old Wolf. Old, old Maid. Old Wolf. I can beat you at your own dang game. Let's go. Alright, this time I'm not even gonna take the maid. Not even once. I'm not even gonna take the maid even once. You see? You see? <laughs> no, this is good. This is good. <laughs> no, this is good. This means I'll get rid of it. <laughs> this means I'll get rid of it. I'll have it now, I'll get rid of it later. That's what it means. Great. That's what it means. Jacob! <laughs> <laughs> Jacob! Immediately! Uh, it's, but now I know I can't pick it. All my picks are good now. Well, now you have to rely on her taking it. She's definitely gonna take it. Don't worry. She's definitely gonna take it. This is good for me. Trust me. She's gonna take it this time. I actually hope she'd take it next time. Okay, this is perfect. This is exactly... I'm gonna lose. <laughs> I'm gonna lose now. This is exactly as I planned. This is just... That one was like a warm-up round. I wonder if there's something about the card that gives it away. I think it was the second one from the right. Well, it's not gonna be the same every time. Well, I wonder if... Because there's always, like, a game to their game. Do you want to play it this time? Do you want to pick? <laughs> <laughs> no, this is good. This is a good strategy. It's good. It's this good is a good strategy. Strat we get it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then she's going to take it back. <laughs> this is a good strategy. Julia's playing this time. Don't say Jacob, are you serious? <laughs> I did it. She's gonna take it back. This is a good strategy. This is gonna work out good. Yes! She took it back. Where did it go? Was it on the left? Was it there? I, don't know. I think it was there. I think middle is safe. We win! You're getting stuck yeah! with the mage, you old bag! Bow, bow! Yeah! You just had to play. That was the key. I did it. I did it through sheer skill. Well, my stars and garters nearly beat me fair and square. No, oh, jeez. You know, if you see my older sister Constance around, you should try to coerce her into playing around with a doll like you. I don't want to. I think she'd get a real kick out of it. Just don't stare at the cards. I guess a little feisty about that. So about the event, make sure you get there at 8 sharp. If you dawdle, you miss the big surprise. I'm sure to knock Pat's socks off. It's, it's sore. I'm sure it's sore. Fuck it. Real sore. <laughs> what does... Wait. Does he wear socks? I'm losing my mind, sonny. I'm getting a little old. A little tired. <laughs> Is he one for the shoe wearing alligators or the non shoe alligators? <laughs> well, something will get knocked off that boy. We'll make sure of it. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent work. <laughs> it's just a lot. It was a lot. But. 
Buongiorno, city pal here. He said Buno Giorno. Yeah, in the beginning I did, I sure did. No, that's what he said. Buno Giorno! <laughs> did you know that's how they say hello in Italy? At least that's what it said on the back of my crisp Rices box today. See. Si. There's lots of different alligators from all over the world here in Alligator New York City. That's why they call it the melting pot. Not because of the strange smell that the sidewalk walk gives off in hot weather, as I originally thought. If you want to meet any interesting people during your stay, maybe you should start on the trolley, since everyone uses it. You never know who you might strike up a conversation with there. Don't talk to people on the train. Don't talk to people on the train. Do not. Poor Taurus this morning was talking to a fella. <laughs> talking to a crazy man. And he was just going off the rails talking about who owes him money. Uh, or who might throw a bag of hair at you and then run away. It's more like that. Yeah. Especially in New York City. Uh, that's a big city for you. Full of surprises. Do not talk. Do not talk. Jacob and Julia are a power couple because Julia can game and Jacob can read. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an expert reader. Let's talk to this old bag. You're late. Oh, you want to do this one? You're late. I've been waiting here for an hour. Oh my god, What I love do her. you mean you do not work here? Well, it's not as if you can fault me for thinking so, what with the drab wardrobe and pathetic sunken eyes. Everything here has the clear stink of death upon it. Oh, except for me, of course. I'm merely a poor, poor woman in deep mourning. Not at all one involved in the mysterious circumstances the police cannot explain. I'm merely a lonely widow left behind for the great beyond by my beloved late husband, Horace. Oh, Horace, always such a wonderful wisp of a man. Allegretta wrote, oh no, not a Luigi board. <laughs> Even at his most poisoned, he forever remained regal, kind, and absurdly wealthy. Now in his absence, I find myself trying to take comfort in the metaphysical arts. If only I could hear his sweet, strained voice once more. So this is the uh, the wife of the rich guy who died. Mm. Since his kids kept saying he was incredibly poisoned. Pat, you mean the one with the ridiculous hat? Yes, I am aware of him. A terrible stain on the bloodline, that Papuli fellow. Created all sorts of nonsensical cousins for myself and my dear children. Once removed at the very least, though it's of little comfort to me. Especially when I see someone like Patrick vault over a coffee table at the holidays. He thought he saw the Spider's Man or whatever nonsense. Spider's Man. Oh, I can't even imagine attending the event unchaperoned. If only my poor dear husband had been less poisoned, I wouldn't have to suffer such horrific indignities. Will no one think of me and my feelings? Your questions grow tiresome. Don't you see you're riling up the vapors? Well, what are you, the lead detective investigating the mysterious circumstances around my late husband's untimely demise? This is every old Upper East Side woman. <laughs> How dare you? I've had no rest for the past week. That or she's from, like, Coney Island. Whenever I close my eyes, I'm visited by Horace's specter reaching out to me. Perhaps trying to send me information about some secret treasure he wanted me to inherit on top of the rest of his vast estate. Will nothing stop his ceaseless haunting? If you could only find it in your heart to help this poor widow, I can give you the information you seek. Just use the spirit board to contact Horace and please find out what my dear late husband wants. Or what kind of evidence he has. There's a lot of ghosts in this game. Yeah. Become a dark patron of this terrifying matron. The bargain of earthly defrights. Wonderful. Follow the ghost through the eye of the planchette. He could get tricky. The faster you move, the more suspicious the widow gets. Planchet. Planchet. It would be planchet. Wiggle board? Wiggle board? What's a Luigi board? I'd 
magical insight into the dearly parted. I have my suspicions. Oh, I was supposed to read that. That's fine. I'm Prove to me voice. you can contact my beloved late husband, or I shall out you as a charlatan to the entire Mean Ladies Bridge Club. Where's the ghost? Where's the ghost? Where's the ghost? Where's the ghost? What's well, going up? Mm. Where's the ghost? Oh. Is this the Garden of Earthly Delights? Because this is wonderful. It's the Garden of Earthly Delights. I Whoa. found him! It does seem like my horse. Perhaps it really could be him. You was the ghost. Where would you be? Where would you be? Oh, oh there he was. There he is. The hell? Oh, there he is. Gotcha! Good contact with the astral be possible. Tell us more, Horace. Like, say, if you know the circumstances around your own death. Oh, we got gotcha. you. Good job. We got gotcha, you, Horace. Good job. Oh, her glasses are hearts now. Ah, oh, jeez. It's almost too much to be believed. Indeed, my very foundations are ruffled. He loves me. My Horace said he loves me even after his afterlife. What a prince among ghosts. What a special specter my Horace is, and so gullible. Thank you, dearie. You've given an old widow a reason to smile again. And also an airtight alibi. Oh, I must go tell the children at once. And also hide some sensitive items in the toilet, perhaps. I simply don't have any more time to discuss the event with you today. Farewell, my medium. What? Hey, city pal. I was just wondering, since we've been texting a bunch, um, have you heard of 9th Street Station at all? I haven't. Uh, yeah, I didn't think so. It's, uh, well, it's been closed for a few years. Not a lot been going on there s since then. It's still got some of the most beautiful architecture of all the underground stops in the city, IMO. I really like it there, actually. I'd really like to go there, actually. I was just thinking, um, if you ever wanted to stop by there, maybe I can meet you. No pressure or anything. You probably have to really help a conductor out to even get access, so it's pretty underground. RFL. Okay. I was actually on the floor that time, but I hadn't fallen. Uh, I'd fallen unrelated to the laughing. Anyway, haha. Don't worry about 9th Street. You can forget that I said that. If you want. A magical station. A magical station. Can you drag, click and drag the store? No. No, okay. I can talk to this guy. I used to be a porcelain doll, but I came to life because of this magic shop. Raspberry Jazz! Thank you. Said y'all are a legit reason. I decided to go to art school. Wow. Keep on keeping on, my dudes. Thanks for the good times. That's dope. That's dope. Thank you. I'm glad you're going to art school. Get good at art. Get good. Get good at art. At least that's what I tell my ex-wife so I can come and sit here all day. I've got a good butt groove going into the shelf. What am I doing up here? I don't know. What are you doing down there? Chicken me. I can't believe the magic of the shop and the belief in the hearts of children everywhere brought me to life and made me a real boy. A 44-year-old boy with high cholesterol and everything. We're going in the back. 
Oh, I thought that was a mirror. Puzzle piece. Oh. No. Excuse me, stranger. Can I trouble you for just a moment? What? You see, I need to seal the deal on a big sale. After you beat my ass and old maid a million times? I'm talking huge. A ten foot tall coat rack of exceptionally affluent and tall alligators. It's for them, not of them. Or... Can you keep an eye on my granddaughter napping and let me know if she's getting fussy? Angel Face is a very good girl, so I don't appreciate... And I don't anticipate you having any weird problems or strange happenings at all. No. <laughs> Julia, please. <laughs> Let's keep the peepers on this monitor and play her a little music if she starts to wake up. Or throw on her nightlight. Is this... Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> what did I call it? Friday Nights at Freddy's? Friday Nights at Freddy's. Yada yada, you get it. I don't know what accent this is. Just this doing is a baby. default old lady. Just doing a babysit. Nothing weird about it. Watch a totally normal baby. Rishi. 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 Don't let ghosts possess this baby. Don't. Target ghosts by highlighting them with the ghost finder on the right. Damage ghosts by using the monitor functions or with the brightest light. All right. What is this? Light? Oh, ghost, ghost. What do I do to it? You use, you use things. Make it brighter. Oh, there they go. Oh, that one disappeared. Oh, they hate that. Oh, you just have to figure out what the thing is that they hate. Yeah. Oh, they hate the dim light. Oh, make it dimmer? Do, 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 do. I think if I leave it here. No, because they're it. not stopping. Hmm, maybe. Oh, oh they, they didn't hate like that. that. They didn't like that one. Round two. So I have to use the light to like get Click them. Click the color button that matches the ghost. So what color are these ones? Oh, they were orange. Okay, I get it now. Thank you for the tip. Who are these ones? This They're one green. On the right is what? Pink. Pink. And then you need green. I have to get the right light for them first. Green. And then blue. These are blue. Uh, actually, I don't know. Brightest light. Brightest there light. You go. They have sunglasses. On. Yeah, they have sunglasses. This is pink. Saturn. Saturn. These are sunglasses. orange. Oh, the the moon. Yeah. We got it. We got it. Pink. Sunglasses. These. And then green. And then pink. And then sunglasses. I see some orange ones. Oh, orange, yeah. And then Those. headphones. Headphones. Get the ties. We got it. Good job. Orange. Not even worried about it. Never once been worried about it. No Good baby's job. gonna get haunted on my watch. That's a guarantee. That's a Jacob guarantee. You crushed it. I'm back. Ah, oh, look at that. Sleeping like the tiniest, babyest, baby, tiny angel. Got a baby oh. badge. Oh, so cute. Sorry to task you with such a boy, but I do appreciate you helping an old gal out. That's so many ghosts trying to haunt that baby at all times. Tell you what, any items with water, fire, or bee related damage are 10% off, just for you. Don't say Nana never did nothing for you, kiddo. <laughs> okay. We did it. Good job.
What? Hey! Are you there? It's Pat! I know we haven't figured out the family is totally nefarious secret is yet. Well. But maybe if we walk there together, I'd feel safer. Is that okay? I'm on my way. All right, Pat. All right, Pat. Pat needs like therapy or. Board librarian. Back again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. There's a peaky, peaky blinder over here. Sleazarius. Do you want to voice him? Well, hello, and pleasant evening, my good chum. I didn't mean to startle you. Oh, no, I didn't mean to startle you. Not I. <laughs> you see, it is within my very nature to skulk mysteriously around corners and like, and the like in deft silence as my mother was a mysterious... Snipper designer and my father was mysteriously absent. Oh, but enough about me. What about you? You seem like an alligator with an agenda as well. Perhaps a mysterious agenda? Well, that's just fine, my friend. That's just fine. <laughs> you know. They say mysterious agendas are the best agendas of all, second only to salacious ones. Perhaps yours is a little of both. This is a perfect voice. Do you have a balog I can follow? A balog! Perhaps a vlog? I'm glad you're voicing him. I see you noticing my hat, but tread carefully, my dear. Tread carefully! <laughs> this hat and the secret alligator society it symbolizes have led me down many a dark and terrible road. Such as community potlucks with spaghetti so al dente, your very soul will ponder the multitudes it requires to chew it. That sounds like <laughs> a, a secret sleepover society kind of kind of night. It does. Don't get me started on our mysterious rummage sale. Our fun. Oh, I skipped that one accidentally. Our community snake spear production in the park. No, no, that was fairly uneventful. I got a puzzle piece. Just from talking. <laughs> puzzle. Oh. Puzzle. Any other secret puzzle pieces? Puzzle. Any other secret puzzle pieces hanging out around here? Any other secret puzzle pieces hanging out around here? Hey! Hey! Oh, that's the guy that was falling in love with the flower on the sign. Zzz, fuh, fuh, zzz. Zzz, zzz, flower, take me back. Zzz. I got a puzzle piece. Aren't the SAS a uh, division of the British military? Everyone's saying SAS for Secret Alligator Society. I don't know anything. Believe it or not. Cat Bookaroo just said, Oh, hey! Oh, he looks uncomfortable. Welcome back, esteemed guest. I'm afraid our kitchen is closed early for the event in the hotel ballroom tonight. I have provided Mr. Pat with some complimentary stale oyster crackers and tap water. I change this guy's voice every single time. If you follow me, I can uh, show you to his room. Let's go see Pat. Pardon me, we'll begin walking at your leisure. Whoa. Hey. Hey. My, what beautiful wallpaper we have. So rich and distracting. Yeah. 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 We've arrived. Please inform Mr. Pat you can't have any more tap waters after you knock. I'm so, I'm so glad you're back. I've just been guzzling tap waters and stress eating these funny crackers the waiter gave me. Even though I'm not going to wear them, I went and got all my shoes out anyway. I think just for the company. It's scary being alone in here. And now the event is about to begin. But maybe since you're here, nothing bad will happen. 
Nugget Maber says the game has multiple endings and your family badges and puzzle pieces carry over into new games. Dope. Duh. Uh, buh. This guy says something bad happening. Can you click something? Do you have a flashlight? I'm scared of the dark. A and of flashlights, but slightly less so. Yeah. Hey, you found one! Do I look like the one video by Alligator Queen? Hopefully with this we can make it through the corridors of the hotel to the ballroom where the event is safely. Just walk really close to me, okay? We have no way of telling who or what is in those twisty halls. Embark in the dark, navigator. Hey! <laughs> Bowers out. Click and hold to guide Pat through the dark hotel. I'm a guide Pat, all right. Ah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you see us walking behind him. Yep. With our visible faces. Wasn't it just a straight line? I think it's different now. Because it's dark. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I'm just going. So let's go, my dude. Just going through this totally normal hotel. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> There's just something unwholesome about reading graphic novels in the pitch dark sediment of a broken hotel wall. I feel you, Pat. There is something unwholesome about that. Did you see it move? I think I saw it move. I don't think it moved. I just stepped on it. That's because I'm really brave. I'm a really brave boy. <laughs> oh, Mandy? I'd ask what he's doing here, but he's attractive to spotlights. Like a moth that smells like hair gel. Goodbye, Mandy. Goodbye, Mandy. The Tinkin. Ooh. <gasps> oh. Let's crank that volume up. To everyone. To talk to everyone you, you, I guess, won against, maybe? Everyone is here! Let's remember all the voices we did for every character. Starting with the barbershop quartet. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you! you. You live in a zoo, you smell like an alligator, and that is unsuspicious and correct. Okay. Right, just one thing for each one. This is the worst party I've ever been to. It's simply dreadful, even worse than last year's. Even worse than the rap party for the Gucci modeling shoot I did. That's Gucci, adult-sized baby bonnets for strange alligators. Even worse than the release party where they found my ex-boyfriend, the house music DJ, run through with a claymore. Sorry. 
Excellent. That did not go where I was expecting it to. I for sure wasn't anywhere near there, of course, but how awful. Simply dreadful. I didn't know if it would be different if I clicked on her instead of him. Tip you out, you're welcome, and good luck with the Henry. Puzzle piece! Puzzle piece! Gotta be looking out for them puzzle pieces. Mercy, it's been a dog's age since I've been to a swinging shindig. You know of any? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Savage. Mostly. On my way over, I passed that abandoned Miss Hoople Dooms home for spooky 1800s children with coughs. And wouldn't you know it, my phone stopped working again. All it does now is sing Ring Around the Rosie in a slow, haunting manner and try to order a stick and hoop with my credit card. Sup, old and moldy. You down for another heist? Sorry to play back in game, but with a cake like this, you know. How can you resist one last score? Hello, star child. May I interest you in a flyer for my upcoming crystal yoga class? We're going to stand on our heads and really give it to some quartz. There's also going to be free pizza in the dumpster outside Italian Tony's cheese circles. Like Bellissimo or whatever. Good evening and good morrow, friend. What an auspicious sign that we have crossed paths once more. Perhaps we have some unknown star dained connection, or you really want to read my zine about cool wizards. Check it out, I have a whole chapter dedicated to Totapicus the Groovy. Oh, I'm so proud of my Patrick. He didn't threaten a coat rack with a coat rack shadow with a stapler and jump out a window. Or dump the punch bowl in the toilet thinking it was poison. This is already going so much better than his birthday last year. Hey there. I got worried you guys would make it on account of the blackout. Pat scared of the jar. And hallways. And parties, come to think of it. This usually doesn't end as well as this, is what I'm saying. The only one which you saw earlier, and I'll break your kneecaps into enough pieces that the old maids can play mahjong. And thanks. Hey, put it there, old pally. It's time for an old-fashioned handshake. Just ignore the snail trail. I'm told it's full of vitamins and helps with drying. And then it comes out my limbs and leaves you crying. Oh, hey, where you going? I'm gonna lose my AARP discounts being up this late. They take a hard look at your benefits if you do too much staying up past 8 or rollerblading. I am not giving up my Tuesdays at Roller World. That was me. Hey, thanks for earlier. I ended up canceling that day, but not because I was nervous anymore. I was kind of wondering if um, you were free? You know, maybe we could go to a real restaurant or like throw some hot dog buns and fat sequels down at Alligator Coney Island. N no fresh. I want to say yes. Yes. Yes is the thing, Majima. Horace and I have come to an understanding of sorts. Wherein he remains dead and courteous, and I don't call in a priest to buy any more poisons wholesale. Can't talk to Horace. I think that's all the ones we got. Yep. So like everyone we collected for the family tree? It seems that way. Nice. Now we talk to Pat himself. Yep. I'm so happy. I wasn't getting rubbed out. I was getting birthday clout. It's so nice to have my beloved family with here with me. We're going to take a big family photo and everything. That means you too. If that's okay. Everything you did for me today, it really meant so much to me. You're really a special friend. I can't thank you enough. Oh, come on. Everything is ready for the photo. Except you. Follow me. Let's go. Hey, we get to customize our character at the end of the game. <laughs> 
That's incredible. That's so funny. Thank you, Castile. You're cool too. Oh my god. There's so many options. <gasps> oh boy. Can we be a weird prospector? <laughs> prospector detective? Alright, we're I kinda to... like this one. Yeah, let's go let's for go it. Let's go with this one. <laughs> this is what we look like the whole time. Oh, Majima! Oh, adorable. What's his face? It's just floating out in the back. He's actually possessed back there. Yeah. Amazing. The game is one. The story ends sweet. But that is... What's really going on here? Does our tale end right here? The more family you come upon, the more true... Truth will grow clear. Guys, that was later alligator. There's our friends oh, Connor no. and Joe. Power couple. Also the music. Mm, the music is really something. Look at all these nice people worked on this damn game. This was such a delight. Oh, MECC Argo was a special thanks. Y'all, support the devs if you can. Buy later, Alligator. Yeah, pick up the game. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's just so much fun to just pick up and jump into. Uh, I don't know if we'll play again and try to, like, hundo percent it, or if we'll move on to something else next time. Yeah. We will find out. We will. When we decide what we want to do. Yes. Uh, but thanks for watching, everyone. This has been a fun stream. Yeah, thank you, everyone. We're ending uh, a little bit early, but the game's done. It was close enough. I'm tired. Yeah. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. We will see you next time. Next time. Goodbye. Bye. Probably Sunday. <laughs>